surface. On Friday, News 13 told you about a Bernalillo High School teacher in hot water for giving a very critical lecture about President Trump. Now, several of her students are coming to her defense. News 13's Ryan Martin joins us with what they have to say. Ryan. That's right, Madeline. These students stand by their teacher, and, she be and they believe she has every right to freedom of speech. They want to make sure her job isn't in jeopardy. Um, all of us were kind of struck, like, what the heck? A group of students, at least 15 strong, gathered today to defend their Bernalillo High School teacher. And if you have a history teacher teaching you that Trump is good, then I feel really scared for you. She was recently recorded criticizing President Trump in class. That recording was brought to News 13 by upset parents. Finances We're told the teacher was then absent on Friday. We lost a day of our education. Our, t our parents are not glad that this has happened because we should be educated just as well as other students should be. Her supportive students made signs like this one because they believe their teacher has the right to express her own opinion and they think the recording is unfair. She's definitely a teacher that sees, she's a teacher that cares about your feelings and education, so I would feel like she wouldn't push someone to believe something they didn't want. The parents who sent the audio to News 13 worried teens wouldn't be able to express their own political beliefs in class. But a senior athlete on a team the woman coaches says that's not the case at all. I personally support the president and me and my coach, we do have debates and we talk about it and we do educate each other and I do see her point and she sees mine. And while they await the district's next move, they hope speaking out will keep the teacher they love at BHS. We all learn from having debates. Our teacher is highly respected in this school. Now, one of the students we spoke with says that they have not seen their teacher uh, since this all unfolded last week. They're eager to know when their teacher will be back at school. Madeline. Okay, thanks, Ryan. On Friday, the interim superintendent called the recording and lecture very concerning and would only say that the district is dealing with the teacher at the, quote, appropriate level. Immigrants and refugees.